And right now there is controversy over an upcoming documentary about the shooting. Social media users and community members are livid with the filmmaker and a Uvalde movie theater owner about playing the film on the big screen. So the documentary is called Robbed. It's about two hours long. It's directed by Charlie Mann. He has done several mass shooting films, including three here in Texas. So in the new documentary, Mann talks with the six survivors of the one classroom where the shooter targeted, or one of the classrooms, I should say. He also talks to teachers and loved ones of the 21 victims. A private screening for the victim's family scheduled for this Monday has the comment section for the Forum 6 Theater on fire. Many think reliving this shooting in this way is insensitive and they are threatening to boycott the theater altogether. Others hope that the film could bring change. I spoke with men Tuesday about this backlash. If they come to you, again and say, listen, Charlie, we need more time. We need a little humility. We need some patience. We, we just, can you, can you give us some space? This is tough for us. What would you say to them? I, I, I don't mean to sound um, cold about this, but nobody has to see the movie. I mean, I, I worked for Vince McMahon at the WWE and he had one of the greatest lines. He said, if people don't like what I do, there's something called the remote control. Just change the channel. No big deal. If someone doesn't go see this movie, no big deal. I, I get it. I understand it. I'm not everyone's cup of tea. My movie is not for everybody. All I'm saying is be fair with me. Don't slam something that you haven't seen. That's all. Theater owner Jacob Henson says he agreed to show the film because so many of the victims' families' members were in it. But Henson says if they don't want the public to see it after Monday's screening, he simply won't show it. Henson also